अपने मूल देश और सिंगापुर में समान क्षमता में काम करने वाले उच्च कोटि के जर्मन वोलकर हरमन ने कहा कि विश्व चैंपियनशिप सीजन में देर से होने के कारण दुनिया भर के एथलीट अपनी ट्रेनिंग में बदलाव कर रहे हैं और उस तरह भारतीय भी समायोजित हो रहे हैं उन्होंने कहा कि 25 से 30 भारतीय एथलीट अगले साल के टोक्यो ओलंपिक के लिए क्वालिफाई कर सकते हैं हरमन ने कहा कि उनकी योजना तीन आगामी ओलंपिक के लिए तीन अलग अलग रणनीति बनाने की है I think we have a lot of dedicated and motivated coaches who probably needs to be exposed to the international level of athletics as well. So, um, from my experience so far, we have to focus a bit more on the intensity of training as well as on the quality rather than the volume. In the next months, in the next years, we would like to focus a bit more on sports science, so that we try to implement sports science like biomechanics, physiology, but also nutritionists and sports psychology into the daily training. I don't think that you can generalize here. Um, we have a couple of very promising coaches who are doing a great job. Um, but it's not only about the coaches, it's also about the scientific experts we need. And yeah, within the next years, we definitely have to raise the level here and there, but it's very hard to evaluate like, or to say we are like 5, 10, 15 years behind. That's um, impossible. Yeah, I think we have to establish a very strong coaching philosophy here in India, that we find a unified way um, where all coaches are working together in the same direction. Right now, um, we have a few coaches like following one model, we have a few other coaches working uh, or following another model, and that's something where we definitely have to streamline everyone, that everybody eventually is working into the same direction. Um, it should definitely be a very close relationship, like not necessarily emotionally, but both of them have to develop a very good understanding of each other, of the demands, of the personality, because if you're spending like 20, 25 uh, hours a week together on the training plan, uh, on the training field in the gym, you definitely have to come along with each other very well, but you also have to develop a, a very decent understanding of the individual needs. Um, here and there we probably need some refurbishment, um, but in general I think the facilities are no excuse for an athlete or a coach not to be successful. Yeah, I think one of our key goals is in the next years is actually to improve the coaches' education and to support our local coaches on a district, state and even on the national level. Um, on the other hand, we also have to improve the support structures for our athletes. We're trying to optimize the nutrition in the national camps. Um, at you can't necessarily say that India is behind any other country, um, but of course we have to do certain homework. We have to, what I mentioned earlier already, we have to implement more scientific aspects into training. I think our goal must be to qualify as many athletes as possible and for these athletes then to get the necessary exposure. I don't necessarily want to talk about a medal. We have the potential maybe for one or two medals, but you know, you don't really know what the other countries are doing recently, so um, it's very hard to estimate like a concrete number of medals.